Welcome to the Know Nothing Know It Alls, where we know nothing, yet we know it all. I'm hip hop legend David Patterson, and this is Charlie Furious. And today we're going to talk about something very interesting. Where did the saying or the, the phrase come from uh, booby traps? Yes. Booby traps. Where did that come from? Now, I have, don't laugh, but I always thought it was booby trap. Why would you think it's a booby trap? Well, it doesn't make any sense. Nah, it's, it's a uh, a very reasonable uh, explanation for this. Yeah. Because I thought it was, you know, like pirates had their booty. Booty yeah. like a treasure. Treasure, there. yeah. That and I, I thought they would hide their treasure in the traps that were yeah. set in place to protect that treasure was called, you know, booty traps. But then I think someone corrected me. He said it was booby traps. And then what I thought I knew about this subject was just thrown out of the window. I don't know much about this, you know. Yeah. Charlie, what do you think this came from? Um, I'm literally thrown uh, because you really thought it was booty trap. I, I just can't even. Yeah. Um. The only uh, the only thing I remember about uh, booby traps are from uh, like Indiana Jones movies. Um, and he was always just about to do something and he gonna get it like the golden statue or whatever and then he uh, stepped on something and he had like fall into his face. It's been a long time since I've seen Indiana Jones so I don't know if any of that's accurate. But um, we'll find out for you when we go do our research. After Hopefully. these messages. What, we have sponsors? Fine. No, we don't have any sponsors. Oh. Just gonna be uh, cut away to a very cheaply made screen that hey, we stole those. from somebody else. Hey, no, but, uh, no, and then we're gonna get this answer uh, to this question that you probably have been wondering about yourself. This has been so, a viewer, this has been a viewer request, so people yeah. want to know. Yeah. So, uh, stay tuned. Okay, and we're back. We did some extensive research, and we're ready to give you the answer to where the phrase booby trap came from. So, Charles, where did it come from? All right, I guess I'll do the honors. Uh, so the origin of booby trap, booby trap actually meant dunce up until the late 17th century. So that's, I think, of like the little kid with the thick cone hat. Yeah, kind of, yeah. Okay. like you yeah. see, you know, you see seeing cartoons. Yeah, yeah, okay. Shows back then, yeah. So, booby equaled done. So, a practical joke would be something that, you know, a, a stupid person would fall for. Mm -hmm. Like the old boot in the door trick. What do you mean? You know, like the door. putting the boot on the, like a half a jar door and you open up and the boot falls on your head. Oh, yeah. Oh. Uh, yeah. Booby trap. Yeah, I'm totally not gonna do that later to you. <laughs> so later on in the 20th century, booby trap came to mean something more dangerous. Like before I said, like in the Indiana Jones thing. You know, lots of times he fell into booby traps that could definitely have killed him. So it wasn't until later in the 20th century that booby trap took on the meaning of more than just what a stupid person can fall for, but actually you know what an intelligent guy like Indiana Jones can call him for? Oh, actually, actually. Lord have mercy. So I think the moral of the story is that booby traps may seem all fun and games, but now they're getting a little bit too serious. It's something that we need to address. Booby traps are a problem. Yeah. So if you know someone who has a problem with the booby traps, uh, get them help. Booby trap, you said booby trap again. But yeah. I, booby I, I, that's, trap. that's something I'm gonna have to yeah. work on. Booby that booby trap. Booby. Yeah. Booby. We're going to here at the Know Nothing Know It All start a booby trap awareness program. Yeah. If you know someone who has, needs help, uh, they can call the hotline. We'll have the number below. Uh, that. But I'll, I'll, I'll not forget to include that number when I'm editing. Yeah. So I'm yeah. sure I won't forget. Yeah. So we want to thank uh, who? Who's in that? Uh, I think that was Richard Perigo. We want to thank Richard yeah. Perigo for giving us the uh, subject for today's show. Yeah. And uh, 
If you haven't yet, please subscribe to the Know Nothing Know It Alls. Alright, so All right. we'll see you next time. Mm -hmm. Did it make sense when I was explaining it? What? Did it make sense when I was explaining it? I don't know. There's a lot of stuttering going on there. Why did I get stutter once? I wasn't a fluent delivery.